good morning everyone in this video i am going to explain about the northwest corner method with unbalanced in last video i explained northwest corner method with balanced problem in this video i am going to explain about unbalanced problem okay before going to solve this okay before going to apply the northwest corner method we have to check whether the given problem is balanced or unbalanced why we have to check only for the balanced transportation only we can apply the northwest corner method that's why before going to apply this method check the whether it is balanced or unbalanced okay how to check what is mean by balanced where total demand equals to total supply if total demand equals to total supply that problem we call it as a balanced check what is the total here here we got 1100 when when in the supply here we we are getting 800 okay here 1100 and 800 means total demand does not equals to total supply it is the unbalanced transportation problem means to convert here you have to convert this unbalanced into balanced based upon the requirement what is the requirement here see here here we have demand is 1100 supply is 800 demand have a excess of money more more uh, excess of demand is there when compared to supply means here we need 300 units of supply to equal the both side means here we required supply okay means here you have to add some dummy rows okay here we have to add some dummy rows first of all write the given problem here these are the sources with these are the destinations here we have 300 500 how many units we have see here 1100 and here we have 800 how many units we need 300 units of supply here we need just add that here 300 and here we we are adding some dummy row that is a3 here just write the zero means here you are introducing the dummy row that's why here you have to write the zero unit transportation with the zero unit transportation here you are investing 3 here you are introducing 300 to balance the transportation problem and write the given remaining demand values okay this is the given problem okay here this is a given transportation okay here check whether it is a balanced or unbalanced yes here total demand is 1100 to total supply is 1100 okay next apply the method what is the method same as it is northwest corner method northwest means northwest means this side corner here you have to start the actual problem here from the corresponding demand from the corresponding supply means corresponding column and corresponding row allocate the least number from both side we have same number allocate here you have to deduct that number from the both sides 300 minus 300 0 300 minus 300 0 here we got 0 here we got 0 leave that complete row and complete column means just ignore this row and ignore this column go to the next column and next row here we we have we got two side zero that's why leave both both row and column and go to the next this is a actual remaining transportation from the corner means here here the actual problem will start from the corresponding demand and corresponding supply select the least number what is the least number 300 allocate that number here did at that number from both side here zero here 500 minus 300 200 okay here we got zero na just leave the this complete column okay means just leave this complete column ignore it delete it and go to the next row this is a remaining transportation after deducting this this is the remaining transportation and here your actual problem will start 
next row shift to the next row leave this complete column why we have to leave here we got zero no? that's why from the corresponding row from the corresponding row corresponding column what is the least number 200 no? write that number here deleted that number from both side 200 minus 200 0 500 minus 200 300 here okay where we got zero in second row just leave that complete row here zero remaining transportation is this one allocate here from here and here select the list from both sides same number is there allocate that number here data from both sides here and here we got zero all transport all the elements is completed next we have to calculate the total transportation cost what is the formula here c i j into x i j c i j means unit cost of transportation x i j means allocated value here here we are allocating some values now thus cell we call it as the allocated cell here we didn't allocate anything now this cell we call it as the unallocated cells okay here to calculate the total transportation cost select the allocated cell and multiply this allocated value with their corresponding values here we are where we are allocating 300 in 25 into 25 plus next 10 into 300 plus 200 where we are allocating 18 200 into 18 plus next we are allocating 300 in 0 300 into 0 okay next add here 7500 here 3000 here 3600 plus 0 add all this 14 1100 okay this is the value like this you have to calculate unbalanced transportation problem here we complete an transportation problem sorry unbalanced transportation problem in this video okay if you like this video please like share and subscribe if you want more videos from this channel and you have any doubts and you, you need any other problems just write your comments in the comment box thank you